Hey guys, so now let's talk about how to build a table in HTML. So we have our body here and our h1 header. And at the start of our table, we want to declare the table tag. And similarly to HTML document page setup, we can break our table into three components, t head, t body, and t foot. So just beneath our table tag, we want to write our caption. So this is going to be about monthly expenditures. Next, we can open our t head and begin to write our column names. So first off, since this is a row, we're going to have our tr tag to specify a row. Then we're going to have th, which specifies the table headers. So we have month, gaths, groceries, and shopping. Now we want to close our t head tag and open t body. In t body, we want to have some more rows. So we declare the tr tag. And then we want to declare the TD, which stands for table data. So for each cell, we want to have TD. So we have September, and then we can have $100 for gas, 500 for groceries, and 200 for shopping. And we can do that for the next two months here and close our table body. And lastly, we have our table foot. Now the T foot should include data that characterizes the data in that column. So here I'm going to have a total row, which is just going to sum up whatever's above. And here I'm going to use this attribute called call span, and it's going to have a value of two. And this means that the cell will cover two spaces instead of just one. So here I'm just going to write 300 plus 1460. And then the last one, I'm going to write 790. All right, now let's open this to make sure everything worked. So now we can see our caption here and our table header. And we can also see all the data columns. And notice here that this spans for two columns instead of just one. This is because we had call span equals two. And lastly, don't worry that your table may look a little plain right now. We're going to make it all beautiful later with CSS.